Aquino leads off the sixth inning for the Tides, who now trail it by a run. Here against the Durham Bulls, have the best record in baseball. The pitch comes up and in from the right-hander Brent Honeywell, has gone all the way tonight. That's now 89 pitches for the Durham right-hander. And Dino's walked and struck out. He will be followed by Washington and Cisco. Here's the kick of the auto delivery. Took something off and missed down low. 105 game time tomorrow. The end of a brief three-game homestand. Tides on the road with games in Louisville and Indianapolis over the next week before coming back home on Monday, May 15th. Check swing and a foul ball back to the screen. Here off the bat of Andino, a two ball, one strike count. Now it's on now for our Venture Tours driver on Birdland, brought to you by Venture Tours, the official motor coach company of the Norfolk Times. The AA Bowie Bay Sox entered today with a 304 team batting average. That's 33 points higher than the second place team of the Eastern League. Bowie also ranked second in the Eastern League with 27 home runs. The pitch here on Andino missing for a ball. That fastball at 94 and a three ball, one strike count. Now, speaking of the Bowie Bay Sox, they banged out another 13 hits in their game tonight. Pitch home. That one's hammered, but pulled foul down the left side off the bat of Andino. A line drive that would have been just about home run distance, but he pulled it foul. Now, Bowie has a 5 0 lead. They're trying to finish off the shutout in Richmond tonight as they're blanking the flying squirrels. Elsewhere in the Orioles organization, Frederick got a fifth inning home run from Lorino, and that was the only run in the game, a 1 0 win against the Carolina Mudcats. Here's a pitch, a swing and a foul tip, and Dandino down on strikes. That's seven Ks for Honeywell.